Hey, happy October, guys. The Horror Man back, and since it's the first day of Halloween month, I will be ranking the Halloween VHS covers. At one point in the past, to honor Friday the 13th, I ranked the original eight Friday the 13th VHS covers. And now, to honor Halloween, I'll do the same for the Halloween franchise. While all of the tapes I'll be showing are in fact official releases, they are all not necessarily the first release of the film. For example, I do not own the original MCA releases of Halloween 2 and Halloween 3, but I own the Good Times releases, which you will see. And while I do have an early media release of the original Halloween, it's not the first meta release. Regardless, I'll be ranking the VHS covers of the first eight films in the Halloween franchise. As always, I will be starting with my least favorite and counting down to my favorite Halloween VHS cover. Please keep in mind, as with all my other rankings, this is just my personal opinion. Again, this is just my ranking of the VHS covers. It is not necessarily my ranking of the Halloween films. And so, here we go. Coming in dead last is Halloween H2O. What we have here is a generic cast cover, popular in the 90s, and just a slight glimpse of Michael Myers' mask. Which, in this case, is probably for the best, since the mask in H2O is terrible. All of the masks in H2O. With the exception of maybe the mask used in the opening scene. Either way, Halloween H2O is my least favorite VHS cover. Next up is Halloween Resurrection. And the fact that this isn't ranked dead last proves I am only ranking the covers, and not the movies. This one gets a slight edge over H2O because it has the cast in the silhouette of the knife. We also get to see more of the mask on this cover, and I like that it has the tagline across it saying, Evil finds its way home. Next is Halloween 2. This here is the Good Times VHS release. The green color they used reminds me more of Halloween 3 than Halloween 2, but I do like that they included the jack-o'-lantern image from the original MCA VHS release. Even though that jack-o'-lantern didn't have glowing green eyes, it still works for me. This one also has Loomis and Lori on the cover, just as sort of floating heads. Next up is Halloween The Curse of Michael Myers. Sort of a basic image here of the mask and the knife with Kara's image in the silhouette. But what I like about this one is the orange really pops on the title and the quote up top. Unfortunately, the camera doesn't do it justice because it looks pretty faded in the camera lens here. But as I'm looking at it in person, it's a bright, bright orange, almost neon. And that's why I like it. Halloween 4, The Return of Michael Myers is up next. Another classic image, just the original mask right here on the cover. I love all the detail. I like the house in the background, but I always found it funny that this mask isn't even used in the movie and that house isn't even featured in the film. Coming in third place is Halloween 5, The Revenge of Michael Myers. Again, they feature the classic mask from the original Halloween, this time with a knife coming down, sort of merging and becoming Jamie in her clown costume from Halloween 4. I have always loved this cover. In fact, to add to that, I would also say this is the cover that drew my attention more than any of the other Halloween films when I rented them from the video store. In second place, the runner-up is Halloween 3, Season of the Witch. Again, this is the Good Times VHS release, but man, look at that cover. You have that classic image from the original MCA release, but we also have the three trick-or-treaters with those awesome, awesome masks. I love this cover. I've also always loved that font, too. Which, of course, brings us to my favorite Halloween VHS cover. It's obvious. It's the original. I mean, how can you beat this classic image? That classic jack-o'-lantern sort of becoming the knife? Or is it the knife in the hand sort of becoming the jack-o'-lantern? You also have this face in the hand, which a lot of people miss, but it's there. This original artwork is incredible, and it's my favorite Halloween VHS cover. So there you have it, guys, my ranking of the Halloween franchise VHS covers. What do you think? Comment below and let me know. Thanks for watching, guys. Be kind.
subscribe.